what I'm about to say is heartbreaking. But you have to prudently handle it. Our meeting with Mazono. Yes. He said his daughter was kidnapped early hours of the day. What? Well, um, that is exactly that was how we felt when we had the news. I'm still wondering who must have masterminded such an evil act. Your Majesty, do you have anyone in mind? Whoever is behind this has touched the tail of the white lion. And I am going to get to the ends of the earth if that is what it takes to fish that person out. When someone wants to protect whatever he or she cherishes, that person can go any length to ensure that everything works according to plan. Mm. Oh no, you are right. But I am yet to understand the context of your statement. <sighs> My son, I understand what you're passing through. Hmm. But you're passing through a very hard time. The hard phase of life is what you're into right now. But don't you think that your recent action is not worth it? Oh no, they are still speaking in riddles. Can you come out clean so I can understand what you're trying to say? Mm. Okay. Must you kidnap Miri? Must you kidnap her? In order to make a point to the king. I, I, I don't know what you're talking about. I, which, wait, which media are you talking about? My wife? I, I, I love you. Okay. Bring her back. Very simple. Bring her back. Oh no, I don't know what you are talking. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, let, let, me, let me just finish. Bring her back. Don't let this matter escalate. Having in mind that the moment you want to fight the king, you are preparing to fight the entire kingdom. Please be prudent. Oh no, where, where did you get this information from? You are talking about my wife, you know. Where did it happen? Where? Where? Like, how? Who kidnapped my Miri? Oh no, where is my wife? Hold on. Are you saying you weren't the one? <laughs> Why would you walk into my house? and order me to undo what I did within 24 hours. And I am confused because I, I, I can't even remember doing anything. What exactly did I do that I have to undo within 24 hours? You know, the more you pretend, the more I get pissed. How could you be so heartless, Stella? How could you? Obi, 
The fact that I love you enough to do anything for you should not give you the right to disrespect or insult me. Don't you ever try it. Because when the devil in one is unleashed, the person can do the unexpected. Have you not unleashed the devil already in you? Have you not? For the fact that you do not love Mary doesn't give you the right to get her kidnapped. Now this is the highest talk of the century. Listen, I'm ready. I'm ready to pay you every time, every time that you spent on me. But please, I am begging you, release my wife for me. Uh, wait, I'm, I'm lost. Your wife? Kidnapped? How? I don't understand. Oh, there she goes again, pretending. Okay, Miss Flash. Mary was kidnapped by Stella just to get me. Is that loud enough? I don't understand what you're talking about. What's all this? What exactly are you talking about? Wait, is this how low you now see me? You think of me so low as to be capable of kidnapping someone? Oh, a desperate man can go to any length just to prove a point. But listen, release my wife for me. I have had enough of your madness in my house. What would you think that I kidnapped your wife? To what end? And what would I even stand to gain? Me? Me, of course! But listen, I'm giving you 24 hours. That is what I'm giving to you. 24 hours to release my wife, else you won't like me when I come back here. 24 hours. What's that madness about? So what do I owe this surprise visit? I thought you were prudent and wise. I guess I was wrong. What are you trying to say? Oh, please don't give me that pretense game of yours. Why did you act so childish? You're speaking in riddles, Mandy. Can you go straight to the point? I asked you to make sure the marriage between the king and the Mary becomes no and void. But what did you do instead? You decided to touch the tail of a lion instead of shooting it. Why did you kidnap Mary? Why are you accusing me wrongly? Why on earth will I kidnap the woman that I love so much? Why? Listen and listen real good. This action of yours is about to cost me a fortune. I'm giving you just 24 hours to undo that which you've done. Else, <laughs> I'll play a tune you can never dance to. Man, did you have to believe me? I did not Mandy does not repeat herself twice. Don't say I did not want you. Have a nice day.
don't want to talk, right? <laughs> you don't want to talk, right? <laughs> 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 Your Majesty, Your Majesty, my King. Please, have mercy. Have mercy, please, Your Majesty. Those who deserve mercy. I am innocent. I am innocent. My hands are clean. Your Majesty, please. I, I did not. How can I keep number? Oh, why? If I did not keep number, please, your mind tells me I did not. I did not keep number! Do you want to die, my hand? <coughs> I swear, I swear by the gods. I, I swear by the gods, and by the grace of my late parents, I did not keep that hand. Leave me. Please trust me, trust me, and please believe me, Your Majesty, I didn't do it, please. At this point, I feel you've gone insane because I know I've warned you countless times to stay away from me. What do you want? Stella, I am that tune you will always dance to all the rest of your life. That does not answer my question. What exactly do you want? I have it on good authority that you kidnap me. Where did you get such useless information from? I am only unaware of something I do not want to know. I want you to release that lady. Else. Else what? Else what I am asking you. So you actually feel so comfortable coming to my father's house to rant at will? How dare you? I'm ranting? Stella, did you just say I'm ranting? Of course you know you are ranting. Else what will you be doing there? Now listen to me. I want you to tell your boy, Sharp, to release that lady immediately. Else I am going to storm their dens and expose you. How, how did you get to know about Sharp? I give you one hour. If you do not release that lady, you are going to see the demon in me. Just shut up. Seriously? This is it? Huh? Babe, just shut up and let me think. I need to clear my head. Clear what? What nonsense do you want to clear? When did you become this hardened? When did you become a kidnapper? Grace, you are in no position to judge me. Oh, please. I have every right to judge you. You heard me. I have every right to judge you. What if your dad got to know about this? What would you tell him? I thought you were my friend. You've changed. When did you become this? What, what, what is wrong with you? Come on. Everything I did was out of desperation. <laughs> I love Ubi a lot. Oh. I love him so much that I can do anything to have him. I need him. Really? Really? Seriously? Okay. Before your obsession will get out of hand, I have a vital information for you. What is it? Is it about Obi? Yes. Obi is impotent. What? You heard me. Yes. He's impotent. And I have a varied evidence to show you. No. No. <laughs> I mean, baby girl, Obi does not want all these fights. Come on, baby. You've changed. 
Hope it's not worth all these fights. Go and release that innocent lady, please. This is not you. Please. Okay? Come here. It's all right, okay? It's all right. It's not just unfortunate, it is a bad omen. As a matter of fact, it is an abomination, Your Majesty. Exactly. It shows on you are very correct. Oh no. It shows on you. Your words are deep. I want to know if we're still on the same page. Your Majesty. We have been on the same page before, but the death of Marziano has torn us apart. You're still speaking, Redos. I demand that you speak in plain language. If there's anything you're hiding, talk to me about it. Your Majesty, Ichi Uzondu is like the crab that cannot be eaten and hiding. There's nothing I am hiding. There is nothing to my knowledge that is outside the knowledge of Onowu and the other elders. To say the least, Your Majesty, I am surprised that you seem not to understand the implication of Mazionu's death to the discussion we are having at the moment. Onowu, what exactly is going on? Onyeze. Mm. Mm. 
asno na ba do bie zo chie na ona ha hazin ha anya when you cut a rope and tie it back it can never be of the same size you see, uh, the, 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 the sudden death of Mahazion has actually affected a lot of things. Has become a clog in the wheel of progress. As far as you getting married to Miri is concerned. Mahazion, who is supposed to return the bride prize paid on her daughter, at the same time, receive your own bride prize, is no longer alive. I'm afraid the, the marriage may not work. I am afraid. I knew very well from beginning that that marriage will never hold. The reason I did not follow you people to the meeting at Maziono's house. Ichi Uzondo, what are you saying? Does it mean you know something about his death? Please, 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 please. It's your kaka. I beg of you. Don't misinterpret me. Don't misinterpret what I've just said right now. I know nothing about his death, please. Hmm. My greatest surprise is for the fact that at the meeting today, mm. the king acted as if he did not know what Ichi Ozon was talking about uh, Mazzano's death. It is surprising to me too. But something keeps telling me that our king knows what he's doing. Well, to me, that is his business. Tradition remains tradition, and we must follow tradition. The king can never marry Mary. Simple. Sure. Refer to me. Why can't I be allowed to be with a man that means the world to me? My king, am I cost? Mm -mm. Don't ever say that again. Why would anyone look at a beautiful woman like you and call you cost? No, you're not cost, my darling. You're just like raw gold that needs to pass through fire to make fine steel. How do you mean? Everything that we're going through, it's just normal. Things that we need to go through for our love to shine. And how long is that going to take for that to happen? Oh, very soon, my darling. Very soon. All of this abnormality, jealousy, envy, you know, would die down. People would get used to our love and celebrate our love. <laughs> you just have a way of consoling my bleeding heart with your sweet and beautiful words. When you know that what you have said will never happen. How do you know that the things that I say will not happen? Hmm? Have you stopped believing in the power of love? You just said to me some minutes ago, that the elders said the death of my father means the end of our marriage plans. Worry not yourself about the words of my cabinet members, but think constantly about the power of our love. For that in itself is capable of seeing us through. Okay? You just have a way of changing situations with your words. I know. <laughs> you just have a way of changing situations with words. Thank you for giving me hope to love and believe in the power of love again. Thank you for coming back to love this imperfect king in the most perfect way. And I will always love you no matter what. Please, my king, can you forgive Obi and grant him freedom?
how I wish the dead can witness their own burial. Why did you say that? <laughs> Mama, where will I start from? Is that the ten cows? Five different bands? Mama, or is it the serve yourself kind of food? Hey? The king okay. really spends lots of money in this papa's burial room. I wish your father was alive to witness that Dobi he was seriously fighting for could not contribute anything meaningful in this burial. Mama, if not for the king, will they see this kind of burial in this kingdom? Nebe. Uh -huh. eh, but Mama, the only problem right now is how do we return the bike price back to Obi? Mm -hmm. Mama, like your father told me, uh, the, the tradition of this kingdom forbids a woman from uh, returning bride price or collecting dowry. And that's it. But the question is, what do we do? What's the way forward? Well, um, I could remember that your father told me that his younger brother relocated to uh, 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 one kingdom like that years ago. His younger brother. Younger brother. Oh, yes, 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 Mama, I remember. I remember Uncle of Fokansi. That's it. Hey. Of Fokansi. But did he tell you the particular kingdom? Mm hmm. Um, 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 ah, yes, yes, uh, yes, yes. Um, 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 ancient kingdom. kingdom. Uh, yeah, I but I don't know if he will still be there. I don't know. But we check. Oh, we have, we have to now. Hey, but we don't know the exact place. Don't worry. When we get to that place, we know how to go. Hey, we, we will ask. You're not going to spend the rest of your life thanking me now, would you? Uh, My thanksgiving to you will never cease. Is that so? Yeah, you don't understand what you have done for my family and I. What exactly did I do? You lifted a huge burden off our shoulder. Come on, stop it. It's nothing. We truly appreciate your kindness. Thank you too for staying true, baby. Can I get a kiss for that? Why oh, you want a kiss now? Yes, please. Mm -hmm. <sighs> there is a new development. Is that so? Yeah. What is it? My mother mentioned my father's younger brother can stand in as my father. Hold on. Your father has a brother? Yes, he does. You never mentioned him. I guess I forgot. <laughs> but he doesn't live in this kingdom. So, he can return the bride prize to Obina and his kinsmen. And also accept your bride prize you pay on my head. I see you have it all worked out, huh? <laughs> I cannot wait to be your wife. Hmm. Mm. The power of love. I am now an ardent believer. I told you you would. <laughs> Come here. Mm. What do you want? And how did you locate my house in the first place? Oh, oh, oh can say, calm down. <laughs> Why not welcome us properly? Um, the, 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 the king is here before you. The king, you say? The, yes. <laughs> oh no! The last time I checked, he's the king of Obodoku Kingdom, and not the king of this very kingdom that I live. I ask you again, Ono, for the last time. What do you want? Of oh, course, I don't need a suitsayer to tell me that we are not welcome in your board. Well, for whatever reason best known to you. However, I beg of you. 
kindly find a place you have to forgive us. Whatever wrong we have done against you, kindly forgive us. Grant us audience. Can we go inside and have a word with you? Audience inside my house? Listen to me. You are going to stand right here and tell me whatever you have come to tell me. And you have just five minutes to do so. Really? Okay. Well, um, a man has right to accept, welcome or reject a visitor. Oh, thank God you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, we respect that decision of yours. But our king needs your help. That is why we have traveled all the way from Oboluku to your place. Please. <laughs> Listen, I do not have that luxury of patience right now. So go straight to the point. Oh no. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, our king is interested in marrying your late brother's daughter. Oh, really? Yes, of course. <laughs> king! And how is that my business? The marriage cannot hold without the bride price paid on her head by her former husband being returned to him. And you are the only one that can do that. Returning of the old bride price and receiving of the new one from our king. Kindly do all this favor. I beg you in the name of whatever you believe, whatever you worship, do help us. Please. Oh no. It is only a dog that goes back to its vomit. All my late brother and his entire family at the vomit I am not ready to go back to. You have both overstayed your welcome in my compound. I need you to leave before I do something very stupid. We should leave? I said leave! Uh, we should leave? Uh, including the king? Yes. With the king. Leave. Or can see other you out of his house. Not just other us out of his house. I have never been humiliated or embarrassed like this in my life. I needed to see how he belittled the king and I. As if we are not existing, as if we are nothing. He abandoned us, left us outside, went inside. Can you imagine? This is serious. How can a focancy be so rude to you and the king? Well, the thing is, according to him, he said this family is a vomit that he can never, never go back to it again. And um, of a truth, Adugo, I want to ask you, what is the thing? Is there, is there anything this family is owing him? What is the problem? I mean, because... Uh, so, her focus see is still harboring that man is in his heart. Even though his elder brother is late. Hey! Uh, uh, Kambi, I'm coming. What? What malice are you talking about? My husband told me that there was a land dispute between our focancy and the chief so. Mm -hmm. And then our focancy, knowing very well that the land does not belong to him, reported the matter to their kinsmen. Along the line, they were ordered to swear. And my late husband then succeeded by telling the truth in order to save the life of his younger brother. This is the case. Hmm. 
This is very serious. I never knew he still has that in his mind up to date. Up to date upon his elder brother has died. Why? This is very serious. Oh no, what do we do? What do we do? This is serious. Hmm. Hmm. This is serious. So this man still has this in his mind. No wonder. Oh no, what do we do? The fact that the lion belongs to the cat's family does not make the cat a lion. Or focus is a principle that a strong with man who has to repeat himself. So the question is, what are you doing in my compound? Uh, Biko, of all can say, take it easy, we are all humans. Biko, hey, look, our people used to say that in your coco mon miriachu, di kwanyamba. Eh? I know you had an issue with my late husband, your brother. But for how long are you going to keep this malice? How long? It has been years. Your brother is now late. Bikonu, uh, allow the sleeping dog lie. There is no sleeping dog in this case. And if there was, it will continue being awake. Mm -hmm. I ask you again. What are you doing in my compound? I stop beating, stop beating about the bush. Please, I, I, it's okay. I am here because of the issue of uh, Mary's marriage. Our daughter, your daughter, Biko. That, you, you can't keep dwelling in the past. Bikonu, you are now the father of our family. You are, you are the papa we know. Yeah? I urge you to move on. Bikonu, now move on. Biko, the issue of Mary's marriage is now lying on your shoulders. Bikonu, I'm begging you. Listen to the plea of a broken woman. There's nothing I can do. There is no peace for the wicked. My late brother brought this whole drama upon his family. I will advise you to go back home and dance to the tune he has established. Hey. Hey. No, please, please, don't do this to me. Listen to me. If the hope and life of your little family is hanging on an edge, and I, of Okasi, will have to be the one to save it, I will sit back and watch you perish. So get out of my compound. Leave my house. Oh, fuck leave. See. Leave. Fuck and see. Just leave. I oh, fuck and see you. I said leave my house. Hey. I oh, fuck and see. This is not fair. Oh. Leave my house. Nkabuzi kwensi kofo. Nkabuzi kwensi kofo. How can you behave like this? When only my late brother stood against me, where were you? When he stood against me, where were you? You are no more fuck and see you. This is sensi kofo. Nonsense. Hello, my love. I am not totally fine. I'm not at all. Can you believe what happened today? Hmm. My mom went to see my uncle of Okansi because of this same marriage issue and he humiliated her. Yes, he, his reasons is because of what happened between him and my late father in the past. Because of the land dispute, exactly. I don't know. He said my father was against him and he lost the case. That's why he won't forgive him, even in death. Can you imagine that? <sighs> my love, this whole thing is getting me worried. It's giving me sleepless nights. Okay, my love. I'll I'll just I'll try to be fine. Okay. No, I won't. I can't give up in our love. I won't do that. All right. I love you too. All right. Bye. Why are you people disturbing my peace? Have I not made it clear that I am not ready to do what you're asking me to do? My late brother stood against 
used me when I needed him most. He spoke in favor of Ijoku instead of me, his blood brother. Now tell me, how do you expect me to do anything that will favor his, his family? How? A focancy. The truth is bitter. We all know that your late brother Ono did what he should do. He did the right thing. And his singular action saved you from death. That is the truth of the matter. But, think for instance, if he did not open up to say the truth, if he had allowed you to swear that the land in question belonged to you, that would have been your end. But, but that is not why we are here anyway. I beg of you, kindly let us concentrate on the matter on ground. Of oh, course, I beg of you, please, do have a change of heart, for God's sake. Marzi, of course. I understand how you feel. You see, when situations like this arise, first, things first, I'd like to, as much as I can, put myself in people's shoes. That way I get to feel what they feel. So that I don't make um, an insensitive assessment of what is going on. But having said that, I want you to know that I am here because I respect you. I'm here because I want peace. I am here because I propagate peace. I am here because I love your niece. Biko. I also want to tell you that I am also not here to talk about the events of the past, that who was wrong or who was right. I'll ask that you forgive so that the innocent children of today do not have to deal with the sins of their fathers. Be calm. Be calm. From your narration, I'm a name a But dozien, butuo. Ah, this is your niece. She needs you. And you need her too. I beg you, forgive my father in any way he offended you in the past. Please don't turn your back at me at this very point in time. Uncle, look at me. Please. At least if not for any reason. For the sake of this child I am carrying. I beg you, Uncle, please. Please forgive me. Forgive me, I beg you. That's all right. Right, my daughter. Listen to me. I have forgiven you and your family. I've heard. For the mere fact that an innocent child is involved in this situation. It simply means I have to do all that I have to do. Stop crying, that's all right. Okay. Mas. Uh. Thank you very much. I know that she appreciates our respect. That's why she wants to see us. Obi, when the tide becomes high, one is expected to leave the water for his or her own safety. I wonder why you are still pretending as if you are not seeing this tide. 
Hello? Can you come out clean so I can understand you? I'll be the king! Made it categorically clear that he wants to make Mili his queen. But you bluntly refused, despite all clears. Richie, so you left your house to my place to say this to me? Mr. Obi, I would love to come in at this point in time. As you can see, we are here for peace and not to stage war with you. I like to hit the nail on the head. The noble elders of this great kingdom and myself are here to return the bride price you paid on my late brother's daughter's head. As you know, my niece is pregnant for the noble king of this great kingdom. And she has made up her mind to be married to the king. So we are only pleading that you accept the bride price you paid on her head. So she can be at peace with herself and then you can also have your peace. That's all we are asking for. Is this a gang up to forcefully take my wife from me? Obi, my son, I know the king has been respectful to you, has been polite, has been diplomatic to you. Do not take that for cowardice. Yes. Don't take it for cowardice. I believe you've overstayed your welcome. You may take your leave now. How dare you order elders of this great kingdom out of your house? In Lewala. Who are you? You don't want to leave, right? Hold on. I am coming. We are waiting. You see, this is very simple. Let's come over here. I need it! Get out of my house! Where are you? No! Idiot! Get out of my house! Get out of my house! Get out of my compound! Idiot! Ano manu! Eh? He was sent you to fulfill your life, my wife, from me! Oh, now you are a man! 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 Get out of my house! Get out of my house! Anu man, anu man, go no, come back. Bring the bright price, idiot. No, 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 she wants a bright, bright, bright price. Get out of the chapel now, you're there. I have never been humiliated like this in my entire life. That good for nothing boy, he had the mind, the temerity to point a gun at us. And as if that wasn't even enough, he made us run like little children. Listen, we should be thanking the gods because we are alive. Listen, if not because we ran for our dear lives, you and I know that we would have been dead by now. So, let us thank the gods for surviving it. So, who be had the gods to pursue you people with God? Eh? He hey. has grown. Obi has grown. You needed to see the fire in his eyes. The anger. When he was pointing the gun at us. Like I said, if not because we ran for our dead lives, we would have been dead. He has gone out of a normal human being. I don't know what is wrong with him. I don't even know the kind of human being he is. Okaka had to run straight to his house. Because he said he cannot come here. With us. That boy has to be taught some little lesson. It's high time he knows that there are certain things he cannot do and then get away with them. I think he has beaten more than he can chew. He needs to be taught a lesson. Hmm. I need to go and see him. What did you say? Oh no, well, you heard me correctly. I need to go and see him and talk some senses into him. What's all this? I go put I go put My daughter, you are not going anywhere. Because you have heard what he did to your uncle and Dolo. Huh? Eh? Do you want to go there and endanger your life? Bah, I don't want anything to happen to you. My daughter, please don't go there. Don't! 
You don't clean the eye and the ear with the same object. Don't go there, please. That man is a beast. As we speak, he can kill. He can kill at any point. That idiot. That stupid fool will not try anything stupid. Because if he does, <laughs> I will show him who I am. He has not seen anything yet. What kind of human being? I've tolerated enough. There comes a point in every man's life when he has to accept the sour taste of life. Obi, you and I... No, stop! 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 Stop this minute! I do not have that patience to stomach the bitter taste of your presence. A lot has happened already. But at this point, we need to think outside the box. Who are the we? Hey, who are we? You and I. Did you hear yourself well? Huh? Did I hear you well, sir? We. How can a selfish person like you use that word, we? Did you remember to think outside the box when you were busy opening your legs for him? Hey, get out of my house now. Get out. Obi, please, I understand your pain. But at this point, you just need to accept the inevitable truth. Please, I beg you, accept the diary. I don't want us to be in this unfruitful war. Oh, oh, oh. So you want me to concede defeat, right? No, I am just asking you to be reasonable here. This is a fight you cannot win. And I don't want you to get hurt. I think you have stayed your welcome. Get out. Obi, please. I said, get out! Leave. Oh. I, I do not want to force you. Leave. Baby, get out! Get out! Marriage, oh for the Munanga. Why I married you out of sympathy? Marriage is for better or for worse. If I go, there is no going back. Miriam, I am tired of this marriage. Oh, for the... I have come here because I have a heart. The bias seen if it am mad. You can know what you look on again. When people find themselves in very difficult situations, you ask yourself, how would you have felt if you found yourself in that situation? I'm here to talk to you. I know that the last couple of months have been long and hard for you. But I am here to tailor your heart and proffer what I feel would be a solution. and see how we can put an end to this cold war. 
Obina, you know that if we continue to fight, uh, the grass would suffer. And you and I would not want to Miriamma to be that grass. It is going to destroy her. And I know that you love her. That is not what you want for her. And so I have come to appeal to you. As your king and as your fellow man to please let her go. I know it is hard. I know that it is not easy. But she has made her choice. Do you want her to continue to live a loveless life? I'm sure you don't want a ticking time bomb as a wife in your home. Because find it in your heart to let the one woman that you and I are in love with follow her heart. This is not about me. It's not about you. It is about Timbiriyama her interests and the choice that she has made. I am not the villain here. I just happen to be a product of the choice that she has made. I beg you, as your king and as your fellow man, let her go. Obi, can't you see that Joko Kikid did not want both of us to live together forever? Can't you see the reality of life that is staring you in the face? What reality are you talking about? That I am in love with another man. Obi. You and I know that this pregnancy belongs to the king. Obi, I fell out of love with you even before I married you. How do you mean? The moment I met the king, I knew he was my husband. I fell in love with him immediately and my heart stopped beating for you. Obi, I married you out of pity and loyalty. I married you because of the sacrifice you made to save my life. I married you because I wanted to fulfill the promise that I made to you. If you refuse to collect the bright price that was paid on my head, I will be forced to live in this house with you as your wife. But I will never get rid of this child. I will give birth to this child in this house and this child will bear the name of the king. Secondly, you will live a loveless life. For I will show you no love, for I have no atom of love for you. I ask you, is this the kind of life you want to live as a man? Why don't you just let me go? So that you can heal and find another woman that will love you and accept you the way you are. Please, I beg you. Please, I beg you, do this for me. Please. Please. 
Please, Ubi. I beg you, please. Just listen to me and do this for me. Please. Hello. Um, it is very clear to me that Chukwu Kike did not create both of us for each other. This is the most difficult decision I have to take. And a very difficult one. I have loved you all through my life. I have made so much sacrifices. But at this point, I, I have to accept my fate. I want to let you know that I, I do not have anything against you. Not at all. I, I want I want you to tell your people to to return the bright prize I I paid on your head. I'm now ready to accept it. You can go ahead and marry the king. I wish you good luck. <laughs> After the rain comes sunshine. Namus, neither can I can hear you. My father told me that an anticipated war does not consume the cripple. Tabu was a calaca. Today is a great day, and uh, we are here finally. We want to first and foremost thank you for the wonderful role you played. Thank you so much. I'm the ghost of this land, of Ubuduku, of your land. Bless and protect you. Yes. yes. Um, in accordance with the list you gave us, uh, these are the items we have come. Once more, thank you so much. In love, thank you so much. Yes. Thank you very much, you know, you have said so much. I want to sincerely appreciate you all for being part of this great occasion today. My king, the lion himself. Greetings. Indeed, I want to appreciate you for coming. 
Uh, without wasting much of our time, I have seen the items you came with. They are all complete. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. It only saddles my heart that my brother, Onu, is not here. But I know that even in death, he's here with us in the spirit. Well, without wasting much of our time, let us do the needful. <laughs> Good news. My daughter, Asamwa, mirror of beauty. <laughs> Take. I need you to take a seat and then show us your husband. As you can all see, today is indeed another great day in our history. Eh? The gods have blessed me. The gods have blessed this kingdom with a seed from my loins. Hey, my son, the heir to the throne. Of Obudu. Today I declare that he shall be called Ikemba the second. Hey. 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 